Hi everybody, it's Tiffany. I am here and I am going to do a quick video. Uh, if you notice, I am in a different location. Um, I've spent the last two days majorly deep cleaning my house, um, getting it ready because it is officially on the market as of Monday. And um, there's somebody coming to look actually tomorrow to preview it before it even goes on the market. So it should be, I have to get up in the morning bright and early and make my bed, and I don't make my bed every day. I throw the covers over it, but I don't make it. I'm bad about that. Um, just make sure it looks good, sweep up anything that my dogs have left out, throw the dogs' covers away, not away, but put them, hide them. Um, put the dogs in their crate, and they're not gonna be happy because they have to spend most of the day in the crate. And I get to go see Hamilton tomorrow, so I'm super excited about that. Um, if you notice, I had been working, um, I've uploaded three videos in the, excuse me, I have hiccups, in the last couple of days, and um, I actually recorded part of those like um, three, four weeks ago, but I couldn't get them to upload to YouTube. I don't know why, it was, I was having major difficulties. I tried to upload them like three or four times and they would not upload, but they finally uploaded. So I was super excited. I got all of them to upload. And so I'm recording this one today because I got this in yesterday, I guess it is. And it's my last official Geek Gear Wizardry box. And it's a limited edition box. So I'm super excited. So I got it in yesterday. Um, I've actually kind of already watched a video online I kind of remember, but I don't 100% remember what was in it. Um, so I wanted to open this and then I need to pack away this stuff really quick. Um, but I wanted to video it and then put everything away. Um, it's kind of sad that I can't have like stuff out to show like my personality. It has to all be put away. So um, anyway, so I wanted to record this. Hopefully the lighting's okay. I'm in one of... The other, I'm in like the back bedroom because I'm, and I'm sitting underneath a lamp here. Woo. Um, but I thought this might be a little bit better area. I'm expecting one of my dogs or both of my dogs to come in here and join me because I left the door open. So anyway, um, let's get started. So like I said, this is the Geek Gear Wizardry Limited Edition and it's the House Elf Edition. Um, and this is the last box. I canceled all of my subscriptions because I didn't want them to accidentally get mailed to the wrong address. Um, also, they're not cheap boxes. And while I love them, um, moving's expensive. And so I'm going to have, you know, a lot of expenses coming up here in about three weeks. It's three weeks. I'm moving very end of June, um, beginning of July. So I'm excited, nervous, but and um, sad all at the same time. So here we go. Let's see what we got. Here is a little sneak peek. Looks like I got a couple shirts. I do remember kind of seeing that in the thing I saw. So I have a gray, looks like gray t-shirt and it's got Dobby and it says free house elves and it's got Dobby and then it's got some socks here and then it says Dobby is or donate a sock. Sorry, donate a sock. I thought that said Dobby. I'm reading it upside down. Donate a sock and then it says spew and it says society um promote Promotion. I'm gonna have to turn it around. I can't read upside down. Yeah, society promotion promotion elfish welfare. So that's what SPEW stands for. Society promotion elfish welfare. So I like this. I love Dobby. Um, he's one of my favorite characters. He's one of my favorite creatures. Let's put it that way. Um, not to be misconstrued with creature, who is one of the elves. Um, but yeah, Dobby's one of my favorites. So anyway, um, so yes, I will definitely be wearing this. So I really am excited. Um, I actually have started ordering the shirts a little bit big because I found that as I wash them and dr I don't dry them, I hang all my shirts, to dry, almost all of my shirts to dry. I'm weird like that. Um, but as I wash them, they just don't fit the same. 
if I get them in a smaller size. So I started getting them in a little bit bigger size and I don't mind them being a little bit baggy because they're more comfortable. But this is super soft, so I like that. So there is my first shirt. And there is a second shirt. And anybody that knows me knows my favorite color is teal. So this is a white shirt, but it's got teal on it. And it says, give, what? Give socks free elves. Give socks free elves. I couldn't read the cursive there for a second. Give socks free elves. So anyway, give socks free elves. Sorry, I had to cancel a message that was coming in. Um, so, all right, well, I looked down and this is the next thing I saw. So it is a spew pin. So it's, um, I'm gonna take this out of the package so it's easier to see without a glare. So you can see here, um, it's got a little Dobby head right here and it's got two socks and then it says spew. So the Society Promotion of Elfish Welfare. So it is what um, Hermione st starts the society in the book to try and help the elves like Dobby. Cute pen. Um, it does have just one little clasp in the back. Um, but I like that it has Dobby and the little socks on there. So that's cute. Um, the next thing I see are some socks and my mother told me today, oh no, I just cut off my video. Hopefully I can splice these together. Um, so <laughs> I hope I can splice these. So I've opened up my two shirts and my pin and now I'm looking at my socks here and, um, they're wizardry socks from Geek Gear, and um, these have a Dobby's head. So here's his head, and there's his little ears, and they're light blue with like navy blue heads. Oh my gosh, my phone is having all sorts of issues, so I'm hoping that did not just cut off. Um, so once again, light blue socks with navy blue with little Dobby heads on them. And they're um, like the long socks, but they're cute. But that they don't really look like Dobby heads. Like if I didn't know they were Dobby heads, I wouldn't be like, oh yeah, those are Dobby heads. But I know they're Dobby heads because of what the theme is of the box. So anyway, if they were this way, it could just as easily be like snitches. So anyway, the next thing is our tea of this month and it's free elf tea. And it's apple and lemon infusion, two of my favorites. Um, I love lemon everything. So it has ingredients of apple, hibiscus, rose, ship, rose hip shells, citrus peel, and flavorings. I have major like hiccup things going on here. Um, so you have one teaspoon per cup, 100 degrees Celsius. Brew five to 10 minutes. And then, yeah, I'm gonna smell it. I love the smells of so many of these, but I don't necessarily like tea. I like chai tea, but it's a completely different kind of tea. Mmm, that smells wonderful. Very strong apple scent, but I can smell the lemon in there. You can see the little pieces in there. I don't want to spill it, but yeah, you can see the pieces. So that's cool. So it's free elf tea. It's cool. So yeah, it's nice that they included that in this, even though it's not a regular box. All right, the next one is this long black box. And it looks like, like a dark mask, like the Voldemort's full followers wear. And for some reason I'm blanking on what his followers are called. Hit me in the comments if you know what they're called. Oh my goodness, why can't, it's like blanking my head right now, my my brain. So let's, oh, I remember what this is. I saw it in Cherry's video. That's why it's got a dark mark on it. This is actually what kills Dobby. It's Bellatrix Lestrange's um, dagger that she throws and she's actually trying to get Harry or Hermione or Ron, or she might very likely be trying to get Dobby, but she throws it. And spoiler alert, she kills Dobby with it. It's sad, it's one of the moments I cried in the movies and the book. Um, but yeah, it's really cool. It has detailing in the little, and this is not real, it's not real metal, um, but it's, it's a very good replica. 
um, but it's got detailing down here and then it's also got like a little skull right here on the handle so that's cool that's why it has like a dark mask on it like for his followers because bellatrix was one of his top followers i'll put that back in the box back in the bubble wrap all right my next thing you know what i didn't have a little card telling me who wrapped my box who or who packed my box hmm that's strange They've started doing that in all the boxes. All right. Oh, this is so pretty. I love this print. This is beautiful. So it almost looks like, you know how like melted crowns look? So that's almost what this looks like with a painting of Dobby. Oh, I love this. Gorgeous, gorgeous painting. Okay. I think that's probably my favorite thing right now. Love this. Okay. That I'm going to have to get a frame for and hang up for sure. I'm going to roll it back up and try and get it back in this tube to protect it for my move. Because my other paint, my other pictures like this, I just like rolled kind of up and put in a, like a box like this. Yeah, I have a box right there. Um, that's got my light bulbs in it but I feel like it'll be better protected in this cardboard tube that it came in. I mean, that came all the way from England. So there we go. So it's back inside there. I love that print. Oh my goodness. Okay, this says, follow our new YouTube channel and win a yearly subscription, The Mad Bunch. Okay, so I guess that's telling me. This is the cheat sheet telling me what's in here. I kind of already know what's in here. And then the last one is this, and it says Dobby the House Elf, and this is a licensed exclusive. So it's got him where he snaps his fingers, and then it's also got a pic him down here, sir. So, um, yeah. So this is cute, um, but my favorite's that painting. Oh my goodness, that painting is amazing. Um, so yeah, let me make sure here. I'm gonna put my trash in the box. There also wasn't any of those little wiggly worms this time. That was awesome. I'm glad for that because that would have made a mess. So it says limited edition. It says a massive thank you for purchasing this Geek Gear Wizardry limited edition box. We hope you enjoy every single item. Um, let's see. So I should have the Dobby print. This. Um, the free elf t-shirt. The house elf house elves t-shirt yep i got both of those shirts free elf socks replica dagger signed house elf poster that's what this was i love this this is amazing um the free elf tea and then the exclusive numbered house elf pin it's numbered i don't know that this is numbered but okay I think maybe they sent a different pin than what they initially meant to. And it's got a little sock on it, so I like that. Um, and in case you don't know, in the second book, um, I, my brain is not functioning. It's really kind of late. So you can see out the window there, it's super dark outside. Um, my brain's not functioning completely, obviously. Oh my gosh, Chamber of Secrets. Um, I couldn't remember the second book. Oh my gosh. Um, but the Chamber of Secrets, Dobby um, tries to stop Harry from going to Hogwarts. And then at the end of the book, um, Harry hides a sock inside Dobby, a book that belongs to um, Dobby's owner. I won't say who his owner is because, you know, that kind of ruins it. And then his owner sho shoves the book at Dobby. Um, to have him carry it and Dobby opens the book with the encouragement of Harry and he finds the sock and by giving clothing to Dobby he has freed Dobby his owner has even though technically he didn't give him the sock so the whole thing is that Dobby loves socks now he's all about socks because a sock freed him so um, anyway so that's what the socks are all about. So that's why 
they sent socks. That's why there's socks on the pin. That's why it says give socks, free elves, all of that. So um, anyway, I feel like I've babbled enough. Um, this is gonna be my last video for a while, simply because I'm going to be moving. I'm going to be, for at least for a little bit, um, living with a friend of mine until either my house sells and um, until I find my new place to live in Florida. So I'm sad that I won't be making any more videos for a while, um, but I will be back. Uh, this is definitely not the end you will see of me um, because I enjoy doing this and I enjoy reading the comments that I see and getting to interact with you guys. Um, and I get some personal messages too and I enjoy reading those because a lot of times those are from some of my kids. So I love love getting those from you guys so thanks so much for watching um let me know in the comments below what was your favorite thing um did you like one of the dobby prints the poster in here that i've already rolled back up did you like the pen did you like the dagger replica did you like the socks or the tea or did you like one of the t-shirts the one with the teal writing or the gray one what did you like um let me know in the comments and um, let me know some things that maybe you would like me to open up whenever I come back in a month or so. And maybe a little bit longer a month, maybe six, six weeks, maybe two months. Um, I'm trying to do a timeline in my head here. Um, I hate to be gone that long, but it, it's going to be a little bit before I feel able to do this. Um, anyway, once again... Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe. Hit that bell button so you know whenever I am back, okay? Um, thanks for watching. Bye. Come here. <gasps> Look. Charlie wanted to say bye. Say bye. Say bye, Charlie. Say bye to him, Charlie. Say bye. And Grimmy's right here, too. Grimmy wants to say bye. Grimmy wants to say bye, too. Oh, well, Charlie's taking off. Bye, Grimmy. Say bye, Grimmy. Bye-bye. And we'll see you soon. <laughs> Goodbye, buddy. All right, we'll see you soon. Bye.